Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I post every day bringing you the latest updated tarot reading. In this reading, we're going to find out what's the most beautiful thing coming towards you. Today is the 27th of December 2023. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 6.25 a.m. Okay Virgo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo. What's the most beautiful thing coming towards Virgo? I kept hearing the word beautiful, beautiful, beautiful <laughs> when I was sleeping. Actually, like before I fell asleep. So it's like I have to I have to do a reading. Something beautiful is coming towards Virgos. I don't know what it is, so we're going to find out, okay? Whoa. It's a card that fell on the floor right here. Four of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Six of Wands is the first card. Virgo, okay, so this is the most beautiful thing that's coming towards you. Um, I'm laughing because, because there's an ending right here, right? Death. Now, the death card has come out a lot in a lot of your readings um, lately. That means, Virgo, things are changing dramatically in a massive way. Okay, I feel like this is for you, 2024. It's already the end of 2023 six of wands this is the most beautiful thing that's coming towards you and i think this thing this beautiful thing is gaining you a lot of recognition admiration um it's a, it's a very successful card sometimes the six of wands can indicate marriage as well virgo some of you are getting married okay this actually reminded me of um <laughs> You know, I, I don't know if you know this because, um, you know, maybe you're not from Asia. Most of you are from the States or England, Canada. I can see from my analytics. But um, Asian, like Chinese, I'm Chinese Malaysian. So when somebody gets married, when a couple gets married, the, the groom will decorate their car together with his like groomsmen the, uh, two of the groomsmen one of them will be driving the car while the other will be sitting on the passenger seat and then the groom will be sitting in the back so the, the that car that wedding car has to be driven to the bride's home okay and and along the way they'll be honking their cars <laughs> and it's decorated with a lot of like big bow ribbons it's, it's very pretty and if they don't have like a big luxurious car they will rent one for the day you know and it just reminded me of that even though you know this is a right away card so this is like back in the days when there weren't any cars yet but it looks like that for me right now virgo you, the most beautiful one of the most beautiful things now virgo bear in mind it's not going to happen to each and every one of you. I'm just going to tell you whatever that I see. Some of it might happen to you or one of it might happen to you. But one of the most beautiful things would be a marriage. Number one. And number two, recognition. Um, like you winning something. Because the, um, the original meaning of this card is this person actually went to war, came back won the war and these are the people supporting him leading the war okay so some sort of battle um this is coming back having the success of defeating enemies at a war and then you've got these people the supporters right um happy just really happy because the enemies are defeated okay and for some of you the most beautiful thing one of the most beautiful things that's coming towards you is you defeating your enemies whether the enemies are within yourself or the enemies and external enemies okay people who don't like you people who hate on you so the six of wands also can indicate hey 
it's like if you if people didn't believe in you they're gonna believe in you if people thought that you were never ever gonna make it you're gonna make it so there's a lot of um there are a lot of accomplishments here that i'm seeing and again for go for each and every one of you is different right but this accomplishment i think you can truly pat your, yourself on your shoulder <laughs> or people just gonna be hey well done Virgo well done you've done it you've achieved it people are gonna be celebrating you and for some of you the most beautiful thing that's going to be happening to you is people celebrating you um, or you celebrating yourself okay could be a milestone um, some of you if you're struggling with any sorts of addictions and um, it, it feels like a milestone that's just for some of some of you like in a way bigger scale right gaining public recognition um, literally everybody's watching you on TV on YouTube on uh, a newspaper okay if newspapers even exist this day these days um online newspapers <laughs> but anyway virgo this six of wands here some of you is what do you call that um sobriety i don't know why i'm hearing that word sobriety some of you it's sobriety uh you gaining control of yourself you're gaining control of your addiction okay that's for some of you is one of the most beautiful things but i love the six of wands the, the last card i was getting a little bit worried wait 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 ah perfect six of wands <laughs> so a death of something right virgo it's a good death okay it's not a bad death because it's a company the death is accompanied by the six of wands and the three of pentacles right here let me show you so three of pentacles work in progress and this is why i feel like this is something you've been working on this is something you've been trying to fix this is something that you've been looking forward to you've been planning right because this person is actually an architect architect is showing these two uh, the priest and the priestess i think you know this is a priest priest for sure and showing this showing the plan to these two about finishing like how to finish the design of the church or the cathedral right and there is something virgo um maybe i feel like this is something you've been working on some of you have been working on yourself okay and you are going to successfully uh reinvent your, yourself okay it's like feels like reinventing because death here for sure um you are not the same you're not exactly the same person anymore you are going to be reinventing yourself or have reinvented reinvented yourself or it's work in progress right um you're on your way there and the three of pentacles again most beautiful thing that's coming towards you it's you finally seeing this church this cathedral finished you know it's done it's finished you're done renovating yourself it's like you are your house right you are what's that word again um somebody used that word recently it was it's, it's my friend she used that word i can't remember what she said but it was beautiful um now you're you are you are your home your body is your house your your body is your home and this is your sanctuary and i feel like virgo the most beautiful thing that's coming towards you one of it is gonna be just you uh building this home inside of you okay where you've been working so hard um turning into a reality because the pentacles is something realistic something physical but for some of you virgo the three of pentacles literally like an actual physical home what some of you the most beautiful thing that's one of the most beautiful things that's coming towards you it's you buying a home finish renovating your home fixing something in your home by um i already said buying a home or moving to a new home and the death here indicates an ending right so in order for you to move 
to a new place. That place needs to go. The old place needs to go. Some of you, it's the old place within yourself, the old you. It's going to be dead and gone. And six of wands, it feels like this is an absolutely amazing, beautiful new beginning for a lot of you. And it has, it's not something that is coming to you easy. I feel it's not easy. Again, three of pentacles, you got to work for it. You got to plan for it. And you've been working for it. You've been planning for it. And it's going to happen, okay? Just keep going. Keep going. Because uh, the three of pentacles, if you stop building, if you stop building, if you stop working towards it, then it's not going to happen, okay? For some of you, Virgo, maybe this reading is for those of you, like, about to give up. Like, some of you. Some of you, I know I can see this very, with such strong conviction that you are just... I'm going for it, man. I'm not turning back with not a thought, right, Virgo? You're just going straight. Um, there's no stopping you because look at how fast the horse is running. It's the fastest night of all nights, right? Five of swords and lovers. I don't care even if there are <laughs> this energy. This energy of like, I don't care even if there are, what do you call? Casualties. <laughs> Just get out of my way. That's what I'm seeing here. It's like, get out of my way. I'm going there. I'm getting there. No matter what, by all means. And you're getting there. Six of Wands. And the Two of Swords is right here. It's you blocking out all the no noises, blocking out all of the naysayers. People tell you you can't make it. People who have looked down on you. Now they're going to look up to you, right? Six of Wands, these people are below, and this person is sitting on top on the horse now people are gonna look up to you nobody is gonna look down on you anymore people are gonna look up to you appreciate you admire you see you as an inspiration um, because you've come from somewhere ten of swords at the lowest you can't go lower than the ten of swords you see how stuck this person is on the floor how these swords are stabbing his back doesn't matter he or she not gender specific so Virgo I see this resilience okay I see this determination of you wanting to make it or you wanting to be successful you wanting to come out of it but for those Virgos who are in the midst of questioning yourself if you're gonna make it or not do not ever question yourself okay just go go for it move for it um wipe off any of the doubts that you ha have of yourself and any any doubts of the outcome because it looks like the outcome is beautiful six of wands and the lovers here is in reverse disconnecting yourself three of cups in reverse disconnecting yourself from people who doesn't people who don't serve your highest good anymore i see that happening um, you know better now, Virgo. And I feel like there's this energy, Virgo. It's like, it's like, I don't know. I don't remember that, that movie, Rocky. It's so old. I don't even know if I've seen it before, but I've seen little clips of it here and there. Um, you know how that when, when somebody is so angry and wants to take revenge so badly, I mean, in a good way where... I think Rocky is a boxer, right? Let me know in the comment box below. It's like that fire, you know? That fire inside of you mixed with anger and revenge makes you just want to prove everybody wrong and prove yourself right, okay? So one of the most beautiful things that's coming towards you is you proving yourself right and proving everybody wrong, okay? And if, if you're not in this state of mind right now, you got to be in this state of mind, okay? Because there's success coming in for you, six of wands. But it takes like a big change, a huge transformation, okay? And it's not easy for sure. Some of you are already on your way there, okay? We've got the four wands in reverse, the star in reverse. This could be for some of you, Virgo, for a lot of you actually, to be honest. The star in reverse feeling like, why is my... Why am I not achieving what I want to achieve? Why? 
four of cups, the high priestess and one first, the higher front, nine of wands and one first. Having faith alone is good. Having faith is good. But there are some things where you need to combine the, the faith and also hard work, okay? Um, it has to be like combined in order for that to happen. Especially if this has something to do with, you know, effort that you truly need to put in. But I always talk about when it comes to love, it takes two hands to ca uh, clap. You can't force somebody to love you. You can't force somebody to treat you. Um, you can just be you, okay? Um, and in, the, in that scenario, okay, Virgo, you can just kind of like have faith and sit back and relax um, because you can't force love. I always talk about that talk about that you can't force love but one thing you can force what i can see right here three of pentacles you can force yourself to build yourself to change yourself death not saying that there is anything wrong with who you were before but it's about it's more about being a better version we all can be a better version of ourselves okay but that that's six of wands again this victory this success that's coming in i think that's the most beautiful thing and you're going to be very proud of yourself as other people around you would be also very proud of you okay clapping for you a lot of applause um a lot of congratulations some of you are getting married three of pentacles is also a marriage card okay getting married um getting engaged um that's the most beautiful thing i see a lot of people coming together to support your union to help plan for your wedding um to come to your wedding <laughs> okay that's so beautiful that's for some of you virgo if you let me know in the comment box below who are who are the virgos who are getting married who are the virgos who just recently got engaged or moved in together who are the virgos who are buying a house moving into a new house who are the Virgos in the midst of intervention, uh, battling with any sorts of addiction? Let me know in the comment box below. Okay, I want to see it. And the Hierophant is here. Hierophant is definitely has something to do with teaching, learning. Okay, and the Hierophant, for those of you studying as well, going through exams. Yeah, that's the most beautiful thing. You're finally free from needing to study 24-7. I am, I've been there, okay, I've studied my ESS off, but um, that's coming to an end, right, the death card, you're going to have this victory, and it's just not just about, it's not just about you having done with your exams, it's about you acing it too, okay, well, for some people, it really depends, but most Virgos are um, perfectionists, so most Virgos aim super high so for some of you you may be aiming for all a's and you're gonna get all a's i don't know how your system works but um in your country but um for some of you you could just be aiming for one particular subject to pass <laughs> that's victory to you for example i'm just gonna tell you um i I wasn't all A student, but I really, I really sucked at math, okay? Never mind, I'm Chinese, I'm Chinese Malaysian, people think Asians are good with math, but my math sucks. And that's because I was, I was never in my class, I was playing volleyball for my school, for my state. I was a big time volleyball player, so I was rarely in my class, so I, I didn't listen to the, the, the lectures, nothing, So I, and I didn't practice it at home either, so I was just wishing like, wait, I just need to pass math, and that's it, the rest, I got it covered, because those, the rest of the subjects, I can just read from the book, and then last minute, that was me, okay, but I got all A's and then my math, except for my math, I passed and I was so happy. I was even happier just to pass my math <laughs> than all the rest of the A's that I got. So Virgo depends, okay, for each and every one of you, it's different. But I definitely see most Virgos are high achievers, okay, most, okay, I would say like 90% of you are high achievers, 
really, really good at what you do, perfectionist. And I see you being applauded for that. I see that happening. I see you celebrating it. There's a lot of celebration going on. Uh, but you're not celebrating something here. Three of Cups and Words of the Lovers and the Ten of Swords. This stretch here for me indicates for those of you, Virgo, if you're going through a separation. I actually just did a reading for those Virgos who are heartbroken before this one. So check that video out too if you want to. Um... Yes, yeah, some important messages over there, okay? Now, Virgo, Nine of Pentacles in reverse. This is a single card, okay? But when it's in reverse, for those of you Virgos who are single, I don't see you being single anymore. But I also see you having a lot of options, yeah? Um, a lot of your readings lately um, are pointing towards you having a lot of options. So... For some of you, one of the most beautiful things is you having a lot of options coming in. It's better to have a lot of options and no options, but also at the same time, you know, Virgo, you got to meet the universe in the middle. You got to go out, you got to mingle, or at least, you know, be a little bit more active on your dating apps, if you do have dating apps. Um, and it's not a bad thing, okay? It's not a bad thing to have dating apps, doesn't matter. Or if you prefer to meet somebody in real life, then go out there. I myself have to push myself to go out and meet people <laughs> because I know I am too comfortable being at home um, because I'm also Virgo, by the way, and I can be so much of an introvert that I don't care about going out, but I've been pushing myself to go out. And when I go out, I just go super crazy, too happy, uh, but <laughs> it's just these two extremes, right? Either I go out, I go all out, I'm like home and just don't want to be disturbed. But Virgo, Knight of Wands here is in reverse, the high persistent in reverse. All will be revealed to you in time, okay? All will be revealed to you in time. The higher finding case commitment as well, some confirmation, something becoming official, okay? Something is turning official. And also, the Harifan, one of the most beautiful things that's coming towards you is a lesson too, okay? It, sometimes lessons can be difficult, sometimes lessons can be painful, but it could be a blessing in disguise, okay? For, for those of you going through hard times right now, um, it could be a very, very beautiful lesson to you. If you were to see the glass half full, then it is half empty. Let's pull out more cards here. Let's see more. Five of Cups in my first. Justice in my first. Queen of Cups. Love. Some of you, something that's coming towards you. One of the most beautiful things is love. Also loving yourself, taking good care of yourself. Even if you are a work in progress, it's okay. You will get there, okay? You will get there. And the Justice here is in my first. Now, Pentacles in love first. So, yeah, I feel like Virgo, some of you, justice in reverse can indicate karma. Maybe your karmic debt is going to be over soon. That could also be, everybody has a karma, okay? So everybody has karmic debts. Um, and we'll, we'll be done with it, and then we'll, we'll accumulate extras after that. We'll, we will accumulate more. This is life. This is part of life. But what I'm seeing here, Virgo, so maybe one of the most beautiful thing, one of the most beautiful things is you having paid your comic debt. Like it's time, it's over. Death, death, ten of swords, it's all done. Um, and it's you finally with the higher fun here. It's just it just feels like Virgo, as long as you know that you're on the right track, you're doing the best that you can, and your conscience is clear. Um Everything will be aligned, okay? Six of Wands. Everything finally is going to be aligned. You're going to feel being on top of the world. You're going to, again, gain a lot of recognition. It all is going to be on you, okay? And this is also the prediction that I have predicted for a lot of you, Virgo, for year 2024. So I'm not surprised to actually see the Six of Wands here. A lot of success coming your way, but not just any sorts of success. It feels like it's going to be publicly recognized for like a lot of you, Virgo. Um, something that nobody can ignore, okay, Virgo? 
yeah marriage card marriage card marriage card some of you are really getting married let me know again in the comment box below if you're getting engaged moving in together getting married if you're single i don't see you being single for too long because you do have a lot of options and this part i feel like it's up to you yeah virgo if all of these options if you're gonna pick one or just you're just gonna pick yourself and you're not ready it's really completely up to you but at least you've got options you got partners potential partners to pick from um that's a beautiful thing all right virgo this is your reading i hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm open for personal readings if you like to book me my information is in the description box in the description box below feel free to subscribe to all of my channels um i go live on my main channel which is chelsea love tarot go over there if you want to catch me during my live stream i usually go on for like a couple of hours um and i'll do your reading during the live stream but it's not free okay super chat only um there, but there is no specific amount i don't want to put a specific amount it's my way to also help others by not like you know putting a price on it um but also at the same time i don't want to be taken advantage because i used to give free readings personal readings but i don't anymore okay um because people sort of take advantage of it <laughs> so but anyway try and catch me live on my other channel chelsea love tarot and on this channel if you don't want to miss any of your readings i upload a couple of times a day uh click on the bell notification button okay virgo i love you take care and happy holidays happy new year in advance take care bye